Hey, good morning, everyone. We have a fun show ready for you, starting with a home bakery. It's located in Hamilton County that specializes in adorable sugar cookies that you can order for any upcoming event. Plus, we'll give you a preview of everything you can see, taste, and do at the Fountain Fletcher District's Mardi Gras Celebration Week. It's going to be so much fun, and we're learning about a nonprofit that's dedicated to finding new homes specifically for senior dogs to ensure that every dog there can live out their golden years surrounded by love. Indy Now, now starts, starts now. now. This is Indy Now. Cheers, Jill. Hey, cheers. We, uh, we didn't plan this, but we are giving very much 4th of July for President's Day. We yeah. truly did not plan this. I don't know why we were all out here all patriotic I'm on not President's mad at it. Day. Yeah. It worked out well. Yeah, I love the dress. Thank you. I love the blue. Floofy, uh, As you would call floofy. these, this is floof. A lot yes. of floof. And the socks that oh, yeah. you wear, and I think... Uh, rocking uh, Please uh, observe get a, the dad calves. There we go. There's uh, George Washington there. Yes, uh-huh. Right there, the socks. Yeah, just got to get it over that dad calf there. Ryan lovingly there. refers to his calves as dad calves. Yeah. Just because they're strong. They are know? strong. They're strong. You're and right. You can move a couch if you need to. It, yeah. yeah. Whatever you would need. Maybe a garage fridge. Dad I don't duties. Know. Whatever I don't comes know. up. Uh, yeah. It's going to be a great show. It's going to yeah. be a fun week here on <laughs> Indie Now. We're so excited that you're joining us. And we always like to start things off on, on a good, good note. note. Yeah, we do. Oh yeah, we're getting the party started right now that yes, we you are. can enjoy actually as well. A Mardi Gras celebration since it's right here around the corner at Fountain Fletcher District now through the 21st. Welcome to Laura Giffel with the Fountain Fletcher District and George Turquette, the founder of Turquette's Delicatessen to tell yeah. us more. Hey guys. How, How are, are you guys? guys? Welcome, happy to have you here. Thank you for Thank having you. us. Yeah, you bet. This is going to be such a fun event. So let's talk about how visitors can celebrate Mardi Gras and Fountain Fletcher District. Yeah, so we have over 10 participating merchants. Um, heavy on our food and beverage folks this time through, which is wonderful because obviously this time of year is slower for them. Yeah. So we really wanted to find a way that we could spice things up literally, um, but oh, also yeah. find a way to get people to come out and visit places maybe that they would be regulars at. Okay. Um, or places they haven't been to in a while. Yeah. So um, we have a list, we have everything from king cakes to sausage to gumbo to etouffee, you name it, Cajun favorite, we've probably got it here this week. I love that, that's awesome. Taking oh it to the next goodness. level. Yes. Yeah. So much fun. I'm smelling something amazing yeah. over here. Yeah. George, what are we smelling here? So that is going to be on our gumbo, which we have on mm. special, which has our andouille, as well as some crawfish in there. Oh, that's nice. served over a little oh, bit wow. of rice. Okay. Oh, yeah. Man. I love that. Can we uh, can we put some on that? Yeah, let's pour it right yeah. over there. Yeah, Jill, why don't you grab that? Here, here we go. Here so we go. why celebrate Mardi Gras in Indiana? You know, it's so associated with uh, New Orleans. Yes. Um, why here in central Indiana? Yeah, so personally for me, my uh, in-laws are Cajun, so this is kind of part of what we do, and I felt like nobody else really in Indianapolis celebrates it on a large scale. Yeah. 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 Um, and also our fun, quirky feeling in our neighborhood, I really felt like this was a good match between um, our kind of vibe for our district and yeah. what Mardi Gras is, which is just kind of a crazy over-the-top celebration, yes. right? Yeah, before Lund kicks off, Yes, right? exactly. Now, what do you want people to know about this celebration? What do they have to check out? Mm. Yeah, so for us, uh, like I said, we have 10 folks. We have everything. We also have yeah. shopping. So this is Howlin' Hyde, if you've had your eye on a Howlin' oh, Hyde bag. Good on there also. Yeah, yes. so these are all going to be on sale starting tomorrow. So for us, like I said, we've got a little bit of everything. Um, if George want to share a little bit about what you guys have going on this Yeah, week. so on top of the gumbo, we're going to have a Fat Tuesday burger. So it comes Ooh. with beer-battered onion rings, wow. a andouille sausage on top of a burger patty with a Cajun pimento cheese. So that will all come with like a little king baby mm -hmm. right on top of them oh, as well. Oh yeah, you gotta have the little key I love baby. that. Yeah. yeah, so we'll do that. And then we've also got, you know, our markets open, our restaurants open, we're a full soccer bar. So we've got a little display here of kind of everything that we've got from raw meat, value added. We've got sauces, snack sticks, jerky, all sorts That's of stuff awesome. in our market. Where can people find you normally? Yeah, so we're on the corner of Prospect and Shelby, right yes. across from Duck Pin Bowling, 1106 yeah. and 1110 Prospect Street. Big red facade, can't miss <laughs> us. You'll usually find me butchering meat in the front window. Yeah, great. it's such a great <laughs> area too. It's got all that charm and character yeah. there. And I love what you talked about, about bringing this to Indy because, you know, if you can't travel for the celebration or even I know St. Louis does a bigger celebration too. Mm -hmm. It's so nice to have something like this in our backyard. Yeah, and this is something we hope to grow every year. So maybe this can kind of be the Midwest destination other yeah. than St. Louis for some Mardi Gras fun. I 
I love it, Ryan. Don't How's mind it? me. I've just been enjoying. I've this. got another spoon if you would. Oh like. my God, man! Yeah. This is before he gets it so, all. <laughs> this is I see what's so going tasty. on over here. Yeah. yeah, I actually forgot my lunch today, so this is like breakfast. There you go. Part two. You did. This is, this I did. Out President's Day threw me off this a little meant bit. meant to be. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, let's remind everybody mm. if they want to check out this event, what's the best way? Yeah, best way to find us is on our website, so fountainfletcher.com, and go to our events page, and you can see all the special deals that we have going on. Um, and learn about who's participating and Good. most importantly about all the events that we have going on in the district. It. We're super busy. Awesome. George, Laura, thanks so much for being Thank here today. You. Go Thank check it out, so fountainfletcher.com for more info and stop into Turchetti's and the other local vendors participating. That's right. Thank you. It is delicious. Great flavoring. <laughs> Thank so you. Good. Coming up next, we're going to tell you about the 21 day reset challenge that the YMCA of Greater Indianapolis is offering for our entire community. It could be the start to a whole new you. We'll be right back, friends. Stick around.